first up, we've got the one, the only, the king of the East Coast, Andy. Hey, right hey, here. How are you doing? I am so excited, yeah. Andy. Yeah. Oh my gosh, how are you feeling? You love, you love like a, a food fest, right? I love a good food fest. Oh yeah. Yeah, I love it. I had to bring one of my favorite food items in the world. Okay. We brought some lobster from the East Coast. Of course we did. And we're doing it lobster roll style. Yes. The only way to eat lobster, in my opinion. 100%. So let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, yeah. so where are we getting started Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're going to get started. I'm going to put you right to work, Mary. I love it, Andy. You know hey. that. Yeah, this is so your kitchen. That's yeah. Thank you. So we got some chives here. Perfect. A must in a lobster roll, in my opinion. I agree. I agree. So there's no real wrong answer with this. We could just do mayo. That's fine. But I like adding some herbs. We're going to get you doing the chives. Okay. Save a little bit. For we're going to finish with that as well. Nicely and then we get done. Some fresh dill. Oh, dill. I've never done dill in a lobster roll. Little herby thing, yeah. you know. I like adding that in. I'm into that. And while you're working there, I'm gonna get going buttering the brioche rolls. So okay. this is a must, Mary. You cannot miss this. This adds like a texture element to it. Yes. You don't want just like a boring bun no, here. No, you don't spice want it up soft. A bit. It's gotta be a little crispy, oh. golden brown. Absolutely. Now, so, Andy, hey, this is the key. You are buttering the outside vertical absolutely. edges. Absolutely. Absolutely. This is key. We want a textural play. I yep. like it when you get the bread open there. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, I'm making a huge mess Listen, in the kitchen, like always. That's okay. The butter's already, but we're outside. That's you can right. just chuck it over your that's shoulder. Right. These lovely people over that's here. Right. Yeah. We'll chuck them in the back. So I'm gonna drop these in. Perfect. Hopefully that's not too hot. We'll keep an eye on that. That sounds and smells immediately. It's it delicious. It really is nice. So we've got some fresh lobster. Look okay, at that. Okay, okay. Brought that with me. Nicely done. Got to keep a close eye on. Ooh, wow, Ooh, that's there already. Oh, Holy. We are cooking with fire today, we everybody. We are cooking live here. I better move quick. Yeah. So I'm going to add the, uh, the mayo in here, Mary. Beautiful. And when you got that, you can toss the herbs directly in. All right, and saving some of those chives for the chop? Absolutely. Okay. Just a little bit. I'm going to season this up. A little bit of salt. Perfect. Always. Going in. In there with the chive and the dill. Nice. I like to add a little bit of the, uh, I've got some, what do I got here? Onion powder. Oh, I like Just a that. teaspoon. A little bit of fun. Just add a little bit extra flavor. Yeah. And a little bit of garlic powder. You okay. want those too? I'm gonna check on those buns yes, for you. Yes, please, Mary. We can't have burnt buns here. That is a perfect. Is it bun. perfect? That is I absolutely that. Look perfect, at that. Andy. Mary Bird, you're absolutely crushing it. If you want to give that a little mix, okay. Once you're done with the buns, there. Let me move my chips. Of course. You gotta have chips. You gotta Whoa. have chips. Making a mess here. All right, perfect. So I'm gonna add in a little bit of lemon zest because we need that little sunshine, that brightness. It's true. It, I, I find like obviously fish seafood goes so so well with lemon, but that absolutely. zest is just like bright, beautiful lemon flavor. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right, that's really looking great. This now, is super simple, Mary. We're keeping I, it simple. I love the fact that you did onion powder and garlic powder because yeah. you get the flavor of like roasted onion, roasted garlic yeah. in there without having to do anything. Just exactly. open a jar. Exactly. Fantastic. Keep it easy. This is beach food to me. We could make this on the beach if we want to. Yes. And then I'm just going to add in the lobster here. Nice. So a key part of any lobster roll, mm -hmm. don't be stingy. Don't this be stingy. This is not the time. Be plentiful. Yes. So we'll keep that tail out, but I can add that directly in. Oh, yeah. Look at that. In we go. You know what? It's true. Lobster Lobster, I feel like, gets a rap of being very fancy. Very oh. like, ooh, no, like my little me. nibbles. No, I want a big lobster roll. Yeah. Agreed. Full Agreed. of so much lobster, you can't even see the roll. That's it. Yeah. This is the whole thing. Yeah. So what we're going to do here, we'll load these up. OK. And a key, Mary, mm -hmm. for serving lobster rolls, plain chips. Plain chips? Salt and vinegar if you're feeling crazy. That's crazy. But okay. this is all you got to do all here. Right. So I'm going to get you to load that in there. Load it right like. on in. OK. Ooh, look again. at all that yeah. lobster. Look at that. We're going in big. We're going in big. Look Beautiful. At that. Perfect. Oh, yeah. That is unbelievable. That's all a thing right. of beauty right there. This is how you do it, too. The two-handers. That's right. That's what you got to do. More. A little bit more. Oh, Ooh. my goodness. Nicely done. Don't worry. I'm not leaving you yeah. hanging. Might not be a budget meal, but this no. is going to be delicious. <laughs> we'll finish with a little uh, fresh Chive, uh, chive action. Here. And then, of course, some chips on the side. Oh, my gosh, yes. I actually did lobster rolls on MasterChef you in did? the finale. You did. And did some salt and vinegar chips there, trying to oh, fancy it up I, yeah, you got it. I really like the fact, Andy Hay, that for you, a fancy chip, salt and vin. That's right. That's a very fancy chip. It's very chip. haute cuisine, haute it, cuisine It very chimney. much is. All right, <laughs> yeah, exactly. I simply cannot wait. I feel like we need to give this a little bit of a taste to real. I think we do, you feeling absolutely. it? Okay, cool. So my first bite of a lobster roll, Always just plain as is, yep. quite delicious. Yep. So I'm going in. Go Wanna do this? It. Okay, I'm going over yep. the bowl. I'm gonna get uh -huh. mayo all over my face here. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh my god. The real trick though here is you get a chip and you put it on your next bite. Because then you get a little bit extra crunch. Not Mary's first lobster roll here, folks. I love that. Andy Hay. I'm simply covered in That's mayonnaise. That's so, I know me too. I'm feeling excellent about it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not even gonna clean it. No. Because it's gonna get worse before it gets better. That's true. Mm. Andy, absolutely delicious. This is so, so wonderful. And just in case y'all are gonna do some outdoor cooking this season, you're all going home with Crate and Barrel's all clad nonstick outdoor roaster. Let's go! How exciting. Andy, absolutely. Hey, Mary here. 
What did you think? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more of the good stuff.